crossing it in. Oh, lucky. Pianic there. Has a shot there. And scores, making it 1 0, people. There we are. Finally, it's going to go there. I don't care if she's down. I'm making peas, I make pounds. I don't want to hear no words of advice. Hey guys, my mate's time. Welcome to episode number four of the Intangible series, guys. And well, last was great. With the, uh, it was a long episode, so I <laughs> appreciate you guys watching that. So it's really, really cool. And yeah, with that being said, obviously, check in the office straight away and see what we um, have to see. Obviously, so we've got a scout update. Let's check that quickly. Okay, we've, these are the youth scouts obviously, that we have uh, sent our uh, scout to check out. And obviously, we've got some decent here, but I see. Is overall, I'm just looking at the overall. Is that it's such a big gap? See, 62 to 84 is a big gap, man. If just one of them had 70 plus, I'll go for them straight away. But this guy seems kind of like I want to go for this guy here just because of it being 88. Yeah, I mean, and mm, the position actually. Wait a second, to be honest, this guy might be the better shot because just because of his, his age, he's more likely to be used. Yeah, I mean, yeah, I mean, I'm at, I think I'm gonna sign this guy here. I'm going to I'll just sign just buddy as one do. And I'm gonna get rid of uh which is bare look. This guy right I'm gonna reject player strip. Seventy, same as this guy. It's not it's not good for that Juventus standards, you know what I mean? Baby standard. Uh this guy It's because of a good overall man, it's just so low. Thirty-seven to fifty-three, it's such a big it's such a big gap. So here for example is forty six to sixty two. So I don't want to go for this guy as well. But I want to reject these guys straight up. I'm not gonna waste time with it. Simple as. And obviously got one more email. So you think okay? And obviously went thing went out last episode. We found out anyway. Okay then. Just want to tell you thank you for helping the club reach one of its brand exposure goals that we set out to accomplish this season. We wanted to earn at least 200 million from shirt sales this season. We could have done. Wait, I already did that. Mad. We haven't even got to the season yet. We haven't even got. Is it because we signed Pogba? It must be because we signed Pogba. That's the only reason why we got this. He's going to uh, shirt sales, yeah? Pogba, man. Ronaldo. See, look at that, man. Mad. Shirt sales. Yeah, I think it's because of Pogba, really. Pogba, obviously, we've got such big players in our team that it's naturally it's gonna happen. So, I won't play any of game. It's only cool. Let's see. Youth development. Bank exposure. Mad. That's, that's too quick, though. Earn 20 million for media earnings. Caution prize was in VZ last. I might do that, but we'll see. But yeah, mad. That is actually kind of mad. Okay, then. <laughs> we'll take it. We'll fully take it. And yeah, uh, with that, to be sim forward here. And obviously, we've got a game coming up soon as well. Okay, loan for Kings got retracted. I was supposed to get let him go for loan, but I said I forgot to accept it. But yeah, mm, doesn't matter. Let's go to the press conference there quickly. And obviously, um, we're going to motivate Juventus here. Yeah, simple. And we're just going to train our uh, players here quickly so that. Oh, wait, I haven't chosen another player. It's chose. I, I let him go, didn't I? Yeah, I let him go. Um, who should I choose? You know, I'm not going to choose someone that's young, man. Oh, we've got. So we can change the youth squad as well, mate. Okay, definitely do that then. We'll do one on one bucket race. Let's do that. Simple as. Simple stuff, nothing too extreme. And you got A's in it. Mad. Okay, then. Fontana might be a good player. It's mad. Okay, that's kind of good. We've got for Keen. 10 million for Keen. Ooh. So guys, we have an offer here for Sandro people. Um, they're offering 53 million euros for them. We can get up to possibly 76. Uh, which I think we might I might just get maybe 70, maybe 60 more if possible. Uh, but that will be a good amount. But I think, um, obviously, as uh, Breezy said, that to obviously sell him uh, in exchange for a, uh, what do you call it? For uh, Marcelo, but obviously Marcelo is not in the situation now. As a committed situation, that's going to be a problem. I'm gonna let Keen go here. I'm gonna accept it because I don't think I'm gonna use him to be honest. Um, let him have a playtime somewhere else. So it matters. I'm gonna accept that straight up. I know if people might say oh, I should grow him myself, but I'd rather not. I guess I want to do that. But before I do think of selling him, I'm gonna try and find another player. I try and get another player first. If I can, then I will go for Sandra. If I can't, that's Sandra's gonna stay on the team. I'm not gonna sell him before that. Yeah, I mean that kind of simple as. So I think I'm going for uh, Talis from uh, FC Porto. If you can get him, that would be great. Or for, uh, Fernandez, sorry, um, from uh, uh, what do you call it? From Real Madrid. If you can get him or whatever guy, that'd be great. If not, then uh, we might have to call it uh, call it a no. 
for saying it's under them. Okay guys, so obviously these are the players that I'm thinking of going. I think I'm going to go for Talis a lot more than these other guys just because of their rate. Obviously, here's the thing. I was reading Alaba's thing and he's got a release clause of like 133, uh, 103 million, which is not going to happen because he just went to Liverpool, which is weird, but so I'm not going to do that straight up. So I'm going to remove him for a short list straight away. Fernandez, same thing. He's got a, he's got a uh, release clause as well, which I'm not going to go for him. But Talis is the only guy that doesn't have a release clause, and obviously he's worth around 57. Um, Pretty recently joined the club and won't move again. That's the only problem. So um, that's the only that's the big problem here. Obviously, we have nothing in terms of value for Alonso. So I'm going to sim a couple days further, a couple hours further, sorry. And um, yeah, so I'm just going to I'm just going to do simple as is that yeah, we'll do that. Just so this simple one to see if anything else comes up. So guys, um, obviously we haven't got nothing back yet for Alonso. It's gonna take a while for obviously for us to actually get the value for um, Alonso, which is like should I go for him? But obviously we've got here Alba or Alaba, who's worth around 38 mil. Obviously he's between 48 to 67 mil for him. So we could go for him, but there's this risk. Here's the thing: I I I, I do want to sell Sandro to an extent, but I'm not like in the UK. I have to sell him. And obviously with uh, Marcelo, it's not going to happen purely because, yeah, Marcelo is, they're not going to let him go, all that stuff. Uh, I could go for him, but it's like, I think I could go for Alba and do a straight swap, a full straight swap as you've uh, uh, asked Breezy. But obviously it's like, he's old as well. It's like, it's, it's, it all depends on the whole thing, man. It's the whole idea. Um, with just Marcelo, I'm going to try and go for Marcelo. We'll go for him, but he's going to do a straight swap. But the release clause, that's on the part. So I think I think we can't pay that if we do um go for it. Do you have to pay? I'm not sure. We'll try. If he says that, we're gonna end the negotiation straight there. But if it's not the case where we can actually go for him and we'll do a straight swap without playing the release clause, then we'll definitely do it. Okay, player swap, fullbacks, Sandra. Let's see what they say. If they say okay, then bless it. If they say no. We consider swapping Sandro for Marcelo in the plus cash deal. See, nah, end negotiation straight up. Uh, I don't want to spend money. If it's a straight, straight swap, I've done it. I'm gonna try Alba here. Um, that's my last, last guy to try to. If it doesn't work there either, then we'll just call it a, uh, we'll call it, a, <laughs> call it a no deal for straight dinner on. Seven player swap. Fullbacks, Sandra. They want 27, 29 mil for him. See, that is like counter. Fourteen, but we'll offer no. Nah, fucking fourteen. We'll give him nine. I feel like we've done enough trading this season. If they say yes to this, then Bonnet, they say no, then no. Okay, yeah, that's it, Bonnet. We're not gonna go for either then. We don't have the money and we can't afford to swap him. So that's just a bust. So yeah, Sandra's staying on the team. Um, the, the thing is, that I would love to go for Master Alonso, but I just, I just don't know his value. And he's obviously overall rating and stuff like that. So that's the only problem. If, we, if I knew that would be so great, but I don't. So I want to reject the offer here from Chelsea here. And simply say, yeah, I'm not going to sell him. Uh, received offers here for Sandra. I'm going to reject that straight up. I know we could get a lot of money from it, but just that I just, he, he's a good left back. And we're not going to get anyone for the same price or the same kind of age range with that kind of good, uh, how good he is, you know what I mean? I don't know if I for who? Oh, for a backup keeper. So I'm going to let him go, see, because we've got Chesney and we've got Perrin as well. So there's no point in me holding him back. Obviously, yeah, we might as well let, uh, let him go for a loan for a year. Okay, and Keane didn't go. Keane's thing did not go through. That's what I see here right now. So it said Keane's transfer talks broken down. Talks for Keane's moves to RC Celta have broken down as they have as they couldn't reach agreeable terms. As a result, RC Celta has pulled out the negotiations. Regards, Chief Executive. Okay, that's calm. We don't mind. That okay, it spent 374 million transfer deadline day. Uh, mad that's just been on the last day. Total amount spent today across all leagues. Mad that's a lot of money, you know. Anyway, does it least where they're going away? We won't be playing anyway. I see you think so. Updates, it's these two guys here. So they're in our academy now. 
Nice. We can promote it to the senior team. Oh, that's a shout. That's a fun shout. But I'm gonna leave it for now. I'm gonna let you guys decide if I should promote them to the senior team or not yet, or should I wait? That's it's up to you guys. I want you guys to tell me in the comments down below. So guys, we're gonna head to our first game here, which is against Parma. Um, currently in real life, they're 12th in the league. Obviously, they're not very really high up in real life, but in this current career they are third. So obviously, um, as I like to say, sometimes on FIFA, teams are rated differently compared to what they are in real life. So they can be really, really good in the game. You never know. He's got Javinho. Uh, I forgot that right, uh, right wing. Sorry, right mid, right winger's uh, name. Obviously, I can't really pronounce it, but I know he's sick. Um, and obviously, in past FIFA's, he was amazing. In real life, it's pretty good. It was pretty fast. So you never know. So they could they could perform well. So I'm just gonna try and play my best as I can, and we'll try and get a good good win. Siglio, he finds, or tries to find Pogba. Oh damn! It didn't choose the right player. Wow. Good challenge, there, Chilini. Oh come on, ref! That was a good challenge. Now how is that a foul? That is legit. Is he gonna give him a card as well? If he actually gives him a card, that's kind of a dick move. He actually is, isn't he? He fully is. Oh, you little neek. Come on, nice. There we go, that baller, mate. Go on, die baller. Have a shot there. Oh, keep it. It's easy save, to be honest. Come on, Pianic, mate. Sending a good ball. Pogba. Oh, unlucky Pogba gone. Win that. Oh, what? Oh, what? did my play clear that? I have no idea. Come on. Easy. Nice, Dennis Andro. Nice, Benucci. Come on. Pianic there. Finds Costa out wide. Crossing it in. Oh, unlucky. Pianic there. Has a shot there. And scores, making it 1 0, people. There we are. Finally scoring a goal there. We've been so much pressure from the beginning of this game. And we're last broken through. Great, great goal there. Where's that now? We are winning 1 0, guys. Come on, Costa, man. I know you're fast, son. Keep up. Nicely done, the Perry and my guy. Okay, damn it. I didn't know he was there. Come on. Unlucky. Has a shot there. Oh my god. I thought I was going in. I don't know why. I thought I was going in. Mad lucky. Keep it going. Nice, Sonny. Finds Menzik. That baller. Finds Costa. Has a shot there. And scores. Making it 2 0, people. A good movement there. A very good movement there from the team. And we'll see with a beautiful finish there by Costa as well. Can't, oh, Mandzukic just couldn't keep the ball. Couldn't get to the ball, actually. Uh, Sandro, come on. Oh, unlucky to Sandro. Oh, she has a shot there and straight to Perrin's hands. Thank God. Daibada. Got to Costa out wide. The Pogba out wide, sorry. To Daibala again. He had the first time shot there and scores, making it 3 0, people. What a goal there. My guy, Daibada. What a beautiful finish. That was an amazing finish there. Mad. Okay, guys, we're gonna make a couple changes here, guys. We're gonna bring on Ronaldo, Matuidi, Ford, Dybala, and Pianic, guys. They're both really tired. A lot of people are actually tired, I ain't gonna lie to you, but I thought I'd change those plays instead. Give him a break and obviously give this guy to go instead to Ronaldo. He's finding Costa out wide, nice. He has a shot there and scores, making it 4 0, people. What a beautiful goal there. I wasn't expecting to go, I ain't gonna lie to you. I thought I'd give it a go, but that was an amazing finish there by my guy Costa. To Ronaldo. Ronaldo has a shot there and scores, making it 5 0. A beautiful goal there by Ronaldo. I think my difficulty might be a bit too low for this. Because it seems way too easy from this score now. What the hell? And that's it. That's the end of the game. The people we win the game 5 0. Big, big win. I think I might have to reduce difficulty, but we'll see how it goes. We'll see how it goes. So it goes ahead to the next game against Sociolo. Um, or Sassio, I think it's pronounced, I'm not sure if you pronounce it. But um, yeah, this is our team. We're going to leave it as it is. I've made no changes at all because it's so well against Parama. I have no need to change it. I'm going to leave it as it is. And yeah, if, see, if the difficulty is very still easy for me, for example, I'm able to score a high uh, goal games or that stuff, what you call it, and then win easily, then I will obviously start uh, increasing my difficulty to world class from the next episode. Uh, I'll leave it for now. I don't want to do any changes throughout this episode, in, in my opinion. But I'll, I'll, maybe, I'll maybe do it next episode, uh, depending on how these next two games go. And anyway, with that means that obviously head to this game here and let's try and get another win. Pianic finds Sane. Daibar there has a shot and scores, making it one. No, I can't actually get up. Wow, 
Wait, no, it's, Man- wait, it's Mandzukic. I've always that ball for some dummies, I don't know why. But that was just a good move in there from uh, Mandzukic there. To get in front of a beautiful uh, cross there as well from Sane. And a good finish as well, man. Good, good finish. And yeah, not a bad first goal to be in this game. It's not a bad, that's actually a really good finish, I ain't gonna lie to you. From the angle as well. It's a good finish. And with that, we're now winning 1 0, guys. Oh, whoever this Mino guy is. Mino is really pacey, isn't he? Mad. Let's stop Sane in his tracks easily. Oh, Bonucci. That's my guy, Bonucci, there. Go on, nice. Cost out wide. Crossing in. Go on, Mandzukic. Oh my god, that's wide. Damn, I thought I was actually going in. Nice. Go on, Dybala. Sane. Cross it back post. With Costa skies it though. Come on, Costa. Both angle the nice. Debo intercepts that nicely. Finds Pianic. Sane. Back to Pianic. Find Disigli out wide. Trying to see Sane to make a run. Sane finds Thing. Has a shot there. And scores, making it 2 0, people. Oh, it's 2 0. Yes, there we are. A beautiful goal there from our guy, uh, Mandzukic. Again. Oh wow, whoever that guy is, he literally got in the way of that whole uh, free ball. Prince on the ball right now. Finds thing up front, has a shot there, and misses. Oh my god. How lucky can we be, guys? How lucky can we be? Literally, my guy. Wow, he actually missed that. Wow, okay. We'll take that, we'll fully take that. Come on, nice. Come on, Pogba, first time shot there, son. Oh my god, that was so close. That was so close. Come on, nice. Come on, nice. Come on, son. They have a shot, son. And scores. Making it free. No, so it's a bit quiet there because that's got tightened because of uh, Pogba, obviously. Okay, it's running about all the uh, opposition's defence. But mad. Yeah, actually, that was a good part, I ain't gonna lie to you. It just took me a while to find it. You know what I mean? And lucky Sonny was actually in front of the defender. If he wasn't, been, uh, no chance for me to do that. You know what I mean? And it's a good finish as well. And anyway, with that, guys, we're now winning 3-0. Nice, Pianic. To Dybala. He has a shot there, and he's still crossbar, though. Sonny, they can't win ahead, though. Okay, I'm going to make a change and we'll bring on Jan here for Pianic. I thought give Jan a game here, as he's not been playing for a while. So I'll give him a chance here, see how he does. Come on. To Sonny. Sonny has a shot there, and scores, making it 4-0. There we go, people. A beautiful run there by Sane, a beautiful through ball there by Diabala there, and it's an easy, easy goal for Sane to score. I mean, it's a good, good goal there, in my opinion. With that being said, guys, we're now winning 4-0. We're going to make another few changes here. We'll bring on Ronaldo and Quadrado um, for Diabala and Sane, as they're both are very tired, so I've got to give them a break here and let these guys play instead. Ronaldo finds Quadrado out wide. Come on. Quadrado had a shot there and scores, making it 5 0, people. What a beautiful goal there from Quadrado. Not a bad, bad way to end the game, in my opinion. I think I think not going to be another goal now. But yeah, that's a good, good finish there from Quadrado. And then at the end of the game, then we won the game 5 0. A good, good game. Um, not a matter, it was a brilliant game, to be honest. An amazing game. And yeah, with that, um, we're heading to our next game, guys. So guys, the next game is actually in the Champions League against Valencia. Before we do that, I want to train our guys here. Um, see how they do. Fontana, do see. Wait, didn't he level up last episode to 56? No, no, I'm sorry. Before we played the game, so I said last episode, we've been different. It's this episode. Yeah, what the hell? I thought we... I thought we leveled up to 50... He is 56. Why is it 55 there? Okay, that's weird. Maybe it's a glitch. He's going to press comments hella quickly. And I'll see motivate as I like to say and I like to praise just yet yeah, until we don't win I'm not gonna praise motivate the team simple as and yeah with that see yeah let's head sim forward here and yeah we're heading to our next game okay guys we're heading to our last game of the episode which is against obviously Valencia in the Champions League uh team is obviously I made a few changes here I took off um Sane for Quadrado I took off Pogba for Jan I took off Chiellini for Rugani just so that they can get Break, break off there. Bring them on in this obviously in the game. I'll bring them on for sure. But I just want them to obviously be fresh when they do come on a bit. 
because uh, they'll get tired easier because obviously they've lost most of the fitness obviously so I'm going to give them a break in that way so at least they'll perform a bit better in my opinion at least I'll try that and yeah um, with that being said let's head to this game guys he finds Costa out wide for well, finds Mazuki somehow and nearly scores the goal Nature saves it easy though Martin that rebound somehow just helped us in such a big way but doesn't matter he's crossing it in quickly gone unlucky Crossing it in again one more time. Oh, keeper saved it though. Okay, go on, man. Okay. What is it? Let's see how wide it is. it in. Has a shot there and nearly scores. We got mad. Ooh. We've beaten them in a the, the thing game beforehand, so if we know we can beat this team. Why making movements here? Has a shot there and Perrin saves it. It goes for a corner. Mad thing. This game has been so intense since the beginning of this game. Since we get the match, this match has been so intense. Come on, clear that, clear that, clear that. Grab the shot there, and obviously, he's a goal kick. We'll take that. Come on, please. Oh my god, even then, I can't bloody score. This is right in front of him. Okay, guys, I'll make a couple changes here. I'm going to bring on Ronaldo for Dybala, and I'm also going to bring on Pogba for Jan. As a uh, yeah, because <laughs> they ain't doing good, man. Uh, Dybala's doing alright, but obviously, Jan's doing poor, man. But obviously, these guys will make a difference. That's come on, a great shot there. Could have had a shot there. And what a shot again by from Kodra, but Neto is obviously saving it easily as well. Go on, Pogba, you got this on. Oh, I like it's over the bar. Come on. Go on, finds Manzukic. Finds Pogba, has a shot there, and Pogba misses. Come on, son. Pogba, what was that man? That was the chance that we needed just to get into the lead here. And look what you do. You miss it by that much. Come on, son. Come on, Ronaldo there. Three. Has a shot, hits the bloody post. Are you taking a piss game? That was the easiest chance that we've had. Literally, he's right in front of the goal. No one is contested, that, causing problems, whatever. And he hits the bloody post. Like, oh, no. And they fucking score. My players are tired. I couldn't do shit about that. And they score from that. Oh my god. I'm actually annoyed. I'm actually fully annoyed. Because it's not even in my control. It's a bloody game that did that. Like, Fing is tired. So he just was not even like. He was knowing, he's not going to bother to get to me. I tried to get him there because there's a could, but it's could. You know what I mean? And now we're losing 1 0. Go on, Pogba and scores. Finally, you score a goal. Oh my god, Pogba, can you do this like a second ago? You couldn't do that? We had that open goal. Oh my god, man. That's a back in the game, though, at least. Thank god for that. Oh, Ronaldo, Ronaldo. Oh my! If that had gone in, like, come on, game, you could have given me that. You could have given me that. Oh my god. Oh, if Ronaldo had scored that. Oh, that would have been amazing. That would have been the greatest comeback ever. Oh my god. That would have been amazing. That would have been an oh, amazing one that got to win with. Oh, damn it. Anyway. That was just massive. That's annoying. I'm fully annoyed by that. Fully, fully annoyed by that. Oh my god. Anyway, guys, when <laughs> I sent it a game. Oh, I'm so annoyed by that. So, guys, we're going to end the episode here, guys. Hope you guys enjoyed it. If you did, please leave a like on the video obviously it'll be great if you guys would do that subscribe to chat if you guys are new that'll be amazing if you haven't already and yeah with that being said guys um peace